Welcome back guys. We are at the 30 day mark of our graphene coatings comparison. The one that's not in here is the turtle wax graphene. That will be in the upcoming test starting February 1st. Stay tuned for that. Last 30 days, been fairly mild. Almost five inches of rain, 12 centimeters. And as usual, we foam it down, rinse it, foam it, wash it, and we're gonna see how everything is holding up as far as the hydrophobics go. We know that at the two week mark, 303 graphene spray had failed. That was the only thing that we have failed so far and drive victory nano graphene, it was getting weak. Since then, we've had about four inches of rain, about 10 centimeters of rain. As you can see, Adam's graphene ceramic coating doing outstanding. The spray coating, Adam's graphene spray coating doing just a slightly bit less. Drive Victory, it looks like it's sticking pretty good. As, uh, as well as Adam's graphene detail spray. So you can see that it is still eventually coming off, but it's uh, it's not looking too good. We're not gonna call it failed just yet, but we're getting close. SPS Graphene, they're kind of the originator along with Art to Shine in, uh, in the graphene's, graphene in the coatings. They've been to market two or three years ahead, ahead of the rest of these. 303 Graphene, as we said, it's already failed. IGL Kenzo Graphene Reinforced, also looking extremely hydrophobic and the pre-production IGL product called Easy Graphene Spray looks like it's doing great as well. So there's your update. We're going to just take a minute and show you what everything looks like in the sun after I dry it here. Take a moment to remind you that we are completely unsponsored. You will never see paid promotion in the upper left corner of these videos patreon.com slash scott hd and any of the links you click on in the description 100 percent of that the money from that goes right back into the channel i don't do this for money i do it for education and you guys are along for the ride so without further ado please subscribe if you haven't already smash that like button comment down below so this is after I believe this is the fourth wash. It might be the third. So you can see everything's looking relatively free of swirls. That's a defect in the in the hood there on the Adams. Drive Victory, got a little bit there. Adams looks okay. 303, yeah, the rest of them look all right. So we're, uh, we're looking good. So thanks again, guys. Stay tuned for the next update. See you soon.